Today I'm going to teach you how to select the right or the best fall protection equipment for your application. Kevin Muldoon, Product Manager for Lifeline Systems and Fall Protection for the Mozilla Companies. Today I'm going to help you select the best fall protection equipment for your application. So where do you start? The best thing to do is look at your JSA and look at the height assessment form that you may have completed. If you haven't, please complete that. After completing one of those, you will have a great understanding of the hazards associated with the work that you are performing on the job site. And quite frankly, that will determine if you use any fall protection at all. Why? Because you could eliminate it altogether. If you're changing light bulbs and you can eliminate being on a ladder and you can use a pole, do it because you've just eliminated the fall hazard. If you can't do that, then you have to use other means such as possibly a guardrail system which is passive or a netting system. Or if you can't do that, then you're going to use a fall restraint system. And a fall restraint system keeps you from actually being at the hazard, so you won't be. After you've completed both forms, you can compare those to the hierarchy of controls and select the best application for your job site. If you have any questions at all, or you're having problems filling out your JSA, please contact us at Mozilla. We will help you out in any way we can. Thank you.